What's up, O-Doers, and welcome back. All right, picture this. You ordered solid oak panels for your premium furniture line, but when it arrives, it turns out to be particle board. It might look similar at first glance, but we all know it won't perform the same. That's why automating quality checks for incoming shipments is such a game changer. With quality checks and quality control points, you can automatically prompt your team to inspect the material at the moment of receipt with clear instructions and required documentation. But before we jump into Odoo, let's take a closer look at why incoming quality checks are critical, especially for companies like Stealthy Wood, where production relies heavily on component quality. Every day, your warehouse receives materials from multiple vendors. We have wood panels, screws, chair bases, upholstery, you name it. But what happens when a pallet of wood panels arrives with hidden warping or even moisture damage? A batch of parts is technically the right skew, but the finish or material grade is wrong. Or worse, the defects aren't discovered until halfway through production, wasting time, labor, and inventory. And when problems do arise, how do you trace the issue back to the right vendor or shipment? Without a system in place, it's all too easy for these issues to pass unnoticed, especially if the warehouse staff doesn't know exactly what to look for. That's where quality control points come in. By setting up automatic checks during incoming shipments, you ensure that every operator, regardless of experience level, has clear step-by-step -step instructions on what defines as a pass or fail. You can even require them to upload photos or notes so the entire check is documented and visible to your team. In short, quality checks give you a repeatable, scalable way to maintain high standards at the source before low quality materials ever make it to production. Let's walk through how Stealthy Wood sets all of this up. We'll start in the quality app and I'm gonna head to quality control and then control points and then simply click new. We'll name this wood panel and then we'll also add material check and just to specify even further we'll put incoming we use a lot of wood panels in our products and it is crucial that we have the correct material before we use them to build anything so under product here we're going to put wood panel for the operation we're going to choose receipts because this needs to happen the moment the goods arrive. And here in the type, we're going to leave this as pass fail to ensure our team can give the shipment a definitive yes or no. This is just one of the available quality check options. For more information on available control types, be sure to check out our quality basics tutorial, which I'll link down below. I'm gonna paste this into the instructions tab to make sure the quality team knows what to look for and the instructions are simply gonna be verify materials as ordered, do not accept MDF, particle board, or unlisted substitutions. One more thing, under this message if failure tab, I'm also gonna add some additional instructions and just paste them in like so. Create a quality alert with the name of the vendor and the shipment slash order info. If we receive the wrong product, I want to make sure we have a plan for what to do. So we'll make sure there's an alert created. There. It's always good to have a plan, right? Now let's place an order for a new shipment of wood panels to make sure our quality checks are up to the task. We're going to head over to our purchase application, click new in the upper left hand corner to create a new RFQ, and in the vendor line, I'm going to add Gemini Furniture. And then here in the products tab, I'm going to click add a product and add our wood panels. And as I previously stated, we use a lot of these. So I'm going to go ahead and add a quantity of 100 and then click confirm order. Now let's get these panels delivered. I'm going to click receive products and right away this quality checks button appears, which is great. I'm going to go ahead and click into it. And now it's time to put on my Stealthy Wood Quality Control Team hat for a moment and investigate this delivery. And oh no, just from taking a look at this shipment, I can tell this is not what we ordered. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to give this a fail. 
And right here, we see that message that we created before, and I'm instructed to create a quality alert. So I'll click OK. And right up here, there's a new quality alert button. So I'll go ahead and click that. And this is where I can inform the responsible team that we were sent the wrong material and hopefully how we can fix it. So I'm going to title this Incorrect Materials. And over here in the root cause, I'm going to add parts quality. Down here in the description, I'm going to say ordered oak but received MDF. And then for the corrective actions tab, I'm going to add another message, which is reached out to Gemini to prioritize replacement delivery. And lastly, we have a preventative actions tab. And here I'm going to say, maybe they need Odoo. Their QC is pretty lacking. By setting up automated incoming quality checks, Stealthy Wood avoids bad materials, improves supplier accountability, and protects the integrity of its products. Try setting up your own QCPs for high-risk components and see the difference in your inventory quality. Thanks for watching and remember to check out our quality tutorial covering QCPs for manufacturing linked down below. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video.